Yo, what is good, YouTubes? This is your boy in the NYC. It's me, Ray, and this is the EDCC. That is the Everyday City Carry. Again with the mic movement. Mic movement. Got an unboxing. Also Russian today, because I got to get to work. Back is still fucked up. Not at 100%, but maybe about 65 to 70%. Still can't move real quick and all that, but feeling much better. Today we are going to use the BRS Evolve Overwatch. I am absolutely loving this thing. Going to do a review on it. Uh, shout out to BRS Evolve for sending this my way and letting me keep the damn thing. It's pretty awesome. Um, We're going to open this. This is via the Apex Pass Around group, and I believe it is from a Therapeutic Edge. I think... And uh, yeah, we're just gonna cut the flaps and I'm trying to think how to do this properly. Maybe I should just go like this because it's gonna be sealed and all that. Look at this, dude. Look, I know the view is kind of crazy, but it is a big box. Look how light work this is for this knife, yo. What is going on right there? Just, oh, nope, not yet. There you go. Man, this is packed. Wow, oh my god. Drop shot for the people. I've got so many knives here. <clears throat> I've got two best techs and the rest. The rest is packing material. Holy crap, dude. What do we do with this? There we go. Uh, <laughs> Alright, so we've got two best decks here, the Webra and the Camp Camoza. So let's check out the Camoza first, which is this one. Alright, let's check out the Camoza first. I don't know anything about these knives as usual. Best tech box, tough on that. You've got the best tech pouch, you get a little best tech um, striving for greatness card here. Check that out. Introduction, congratulations on your purchase, yada yada. Standard pouch. Ooh, wahahahat. Very cool. You've got your wiping cloth right there, too. Uh, non fuzzy pouch. Let's jam this here real quick. So, this is the Camoza. Pretty cool. You got this sort of gold, bronzish anno. Um,. Some nice milling on this, and an interesting little, uh, look at that, triangle shape right there. Very small, minimal flipper. Let's open it up. Big knife. The knife that comes to mind when I see this is the VDK Strix that I checked out, which is also a Tonto. But this blade is much more pronounced. Look at that. Pretty cool, dude. Expect some dope pictures on the gram if you do like my pics. Let's look for weight reduction. I see two on the side, and I see one on the other side. Look at this unique uh, backspacer thing, though. It ends in sort of a dick cone. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? It's just like... <laughs> Does this drop shit for the people, which is what we always want? Decent amount of shakes on that. Um... Very nice grind on this, beautiful. Uh, I'm not going to try to explain it, but you guys can look into that more than me. Let's show you some views on this camera. Beautiful, man. Really, really pretty blade right there. Um, Who's the designer of this? I don't know. And it's got like steel testing on it. I see steel testing marks on this right there. Um, this is an M390 blade titanium frame lock flipper, of course. Beautiful anna work on this. Uh, decent ergos. Let's open it up again. That's what I love doing here. Pretty nice ergos. Uh, pocket clip. I feel a little bit of trouble there if I do bear down on this. But this is something that you're going to admire and use on, uh, I don't know, whatever the fuck you want. But... I'm going to assume this is expensive, like, um, I'm going to say 180, right? What do you guys think? Um, pretty cool freaking knife, though. Look at that pocket clip. It's like, whoosh, nice. Kind of flowy design, you know what I mean? You got this little thing there, so it's like you did a check mark, you know? Pretty cool. Let's look at the other knife right now. Let me put this down uh, right here real quick. So this one is the Webra. Right? Um, typical Vestec pouch, non-fuzzy. 
and your wiping cloth is right there. This one looks pretty dope. Let's check this out. Look at that, dude. Very similar with these uh, this milling stuff on there. You know what I'm saying? Let's leave that right there. Look at that. This looks like fucking Megatron in my hand from Transformers, yo. Uh, I like the little accent on the pivot collar, on the pivot there. That looks pretty cool. And, um, yeah, same thing on the other side, too. Pocket clip kind of just meshes in with the design. I could almost not see it. And let's open it up. Ooh, look at that, dude. Pretty nice, man. I have got a lot of work to do. On <laughs> the next couple of weeks, yeah, I'm so glad I backed up podcasts for the next 10 episodes so I can focus on making knife content. This is really awesome, man. Uh, M390 blade steel titanium frame lock flipper. Again, I'm going to assume this is around the 180 to 200 range, like both of these guys, because it is M390. Um, let's do the palm test on this one. It is a little bit extended, so New York Cityers or city dwellers... Keep in mind that, yeah, this one, shh, yo, the blade shape on this is so cool. Here, let's admire them for a little bit. Damn, dude. Very cool knives I've got here. The Camosa and the Webra. Very, very cool. I'm not going to carry these today because I'm going to carry the Best Tech Ivy. And uh, what's the other one? Fuck, I forgot. I'm carrying two today. But anyway, let us do a knives up because I have to go. And I can't cut test anything because I don't have any prepared and my back hurts. So let us do the knives up. Damn, that was so dope. All right, my bad. This is the Best Tech Knives Webra. You've got the Best Tech Knives Camosa. And let's do some other uh, crazy looking things here. Let's do the Zero Tolerance 0560 sent in by Ohio Knife Lover. And let's end it off with another ZT right here, which is the ZT 0707. Got that via the Apex Passaround group. This is your boy in the NYC. It's me, Ray, and this is the EDCC saying triple peace with the fucked up back i still do videos yo don't forget to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to hit that bell icon so we can squat up in the comments